Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. My name is Jessica. If you're new, welcome. And if you're returning, thank you so much for joining me back here today. So today is a half style and we are styling tulle skirts. This is actually um, an item that I've already styled on my channel, but it was years ago, right when I started like my channel and I don't know what the heck I was doing. And it was during the fall time, but it's been a really, you know, most, like, well, I think it's one of my most viewed videos that I have on my channel. Um, and I just wanted to do a spring version, an updated version, because uh, tool skirts are just a fun way to add some drama to your outfit. And um, I have some really beautiful ones and how I styled them for the springtime. So if you guys want to check it out and see a lookbook per usual, I will put the timestamp if you just want to zip on through me talking and go straight to the lookbook, um, then just keep watching. All right, so let's get started with the tool skirt. I am going to start out with um, a fun, they're all fun, okay? I am just so excited about this because um, these are some brand new items that I've had or, or I've gotten in my closet in the last year and they're definitely gonna be staying with me for quite some time because they are just some fun tool skirts. So let me show you the first item. All right, so my first outfit I paired Let's start out with the star of the show, which is the tool skirt. I have recently had this on my, um, I had this on a recent Forever 21 haul, and um, I told you guys that I had gotten the black version, which I do. I have several tool skirts, too, as well. Um, they are just some fun, just key piece to have in your closet to really elevate your outfit instantly. Um, so... You guys have probably seen me pair this really beautiful tool skirt um, in a how to style for uh, sweater dresses, and I threw it over my sweater dress. Just give it some fun kind of look. Well, I did a little like spring version of it right here. I added this t-shirt dress, and then I added the tool skirt over. Since the since the tool skirt has a black belt, I didn't want the black to really like be prominent on there and be showing. So I added this huge wide belt to go across it so you wouldn't be able to see it and give it this monochromatic look of course um, and then I added this jacket I added this cropped jacket so it was very casual or that's how I styled it because I styled it with my new favorite shoes let me show you I styled with these Sam Edelman um, sneakers kind of like a you know a golden goose dupe I guess they are so comfortable I absolutely love them if golden goose are this you know, comfortable. I can see why so many people are such a huge fan of their shoes, but even these are a fraction of the cost. Um, I think they were like a hundred bucks. Super comfortable. I have been wearing them nonstop, but I thought they would look really cute with a tool skirt, you know, really casual. I mean, it's a very dressy casual, but you could still wear this to like brunch or, um, I don't know. It's just a fun outfit. And of course you can easily dress it up with a simple change of your shoe and wear it out um, for a date night or something. But I absolutely loved it. It's just, it was so fun. Um, it was airy, it was breezy, and I didn't feel like restricted in any way, but still it was just a really fun outfit to wear uh, during the day. So let's move on to our second one. All right, so this is the, I wanna call this like my more like collegiate look, I guess. Um, so I recently got this sweater from Forever 21 it says limited edition and I just loved it so much it'd be I thought it'd be look great for the springtime with some some biker shorts or something but because I snagged this baby it is like this bright fuchsia tool skirt absolutely love it and I thought the two color combinations the green and the fuchsia just were so perfect it was cropped just where it needed to be so i didn't feel frumpy with the sweatshirt on top but then i decided to add a blazer on top just to give it some more element you don't have to do it because i think without the jacket it looked really really cute but i just wanted to add a little layer i always like to add like a third piece to my outfit because sometimes i get like really chilly wherever we might be you might get cold especially springtime still has you know that up and down sort of weather um and it gets really cold at night so i really love this and then i added it with some some mules just some slip-ons of course you can also make this super casual with some sneakers but i just thought it looked really nice i almost added a baseball cap with it it was a navy 
Abercrombie hat that I've had for years, but my sister, my mom said, no, you have too many colors, but I actually thought it really worked. I'm going to try wearing it and maybe I'll put a picture before I, and just to show how it would have looked with the baseball cap, but I kind of think it would have looked good. So I was wearing a baseball cap that day because my hair was kind of messy um, and dirty. But that is my second outfit. I think this is something you can wear on a date night. You can wear it to brunch um, with your girlfriends. It's a fun outfit. Um, ex like I said, especially if it's at nighttime, you're wearing it and it's a little cool outside. So this is a fun, fun, fun one. And you're definitely going to see this tool skirt styled a couple ways on my Instagram. Maybe on some how to styles uh, coming up here on my channel. All right. Last but certainly not least another fun tool skirt that I have shown before. I don't know if it's still in stock. Last time I checked, they had a few um, sizes available, but it was this one from Red Dress. I got it during the summertime last year, and I wore it with a white t-shirt and some sneakers, I believed. Super cute and casual, uh, but you can definitely, this tool skirt can go so many ways with like a graphic tee. You can wear it with a, you know, a denim button-up, whatever it might be, but I thought it would be nice to have something a little bit more dressier, something you could wear for like Easter Sunday or to church. This would be so per perfect for. So I added um, a just simple white bodysuit here. Um, it's sleeveless, so it was super easy um, to pair it with that. And then I added, th there is absolutely no purple in this outfit, but I wanted to add some more pastel colors, which was so perfect. I added this purple belt around my waist and then to tie in the purple, I added these shoes. I added these really beautiful lilac shoes I got from H&M. I know I got these last year, but I have already seen this color arise already for spring and a shoe like similar to this. I've seen Zara, I've seen ASOS, um, possibly maybe Shoe Dazzle. I thought I saw something. You'll it's going to be so easy to find something like this. It's really sh like a really nice, beautiful, strappy kind of shoe to wear with like, like denim um, jeans with your skirts, dresses. It's going to be a great color to have in your wardrobe this spring. So on top of that, I decided to pair it with this peach blazer just to add another extra little dimension to it. Of course, if you get cold, just add it over. If not, you can wear it without the blazer too, but I just thought all of this color was so pretty and so perfect for spring and Easter and just a change of the, um, just adding some color into your wardrobe finally that we've starting to enter into spring and beautiful weather and putting all of that terrible weather behind us. But that is it, my friends. All right, you guys, that is it. I mean, that was probably hopefully super fast and easy um, for you guys and what I styled and how I styled them. Uh, really fun ones. I will link some similar items for the uh, tiered red dress one because I don't, like I said, um, last time I checked they had a few, but I don't know at this point when I, this goes out if it will still be um, available. If not, as always, check Poshmark, thread up, all those secondhand uh, websites are perfect to find something like this. And then my other one from Forever 21, I know for a fact that one was completely sold out because it was the black version and it was this cream one. But I will look and see if I can find something similar. And then the fuchsia pink one is from Anthropology. I will leave the link because that is absolutely brand new. I got an extra small petite and I saw a lot of people review on there saying that. If you're, you know, in between, it's kind of hard to justify, but the extra small fit me really good. At first, I thought it was going to be too tight, but the more I kind of moved in it, it actually felt pretty good. So keep that in mind. And I'm typically an extra small, small, uh, depending on brand and stuff. So it fit nice. I didn't feel restricted, but all right, you guys, that is it. Stay tuned for the lookbook. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe if you aren't already, and I will see you all in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Kinda simple, kinda wasteful about things And you're kinda simple, but like a pistol you fire Sometimes you get under my skin like a lover And sometimes you don't wanna come back cause you'd rather Stay out with another Talking to strangers and make out spontaneously Now I'm 